I'm Kawiya Najib. I'm a human rights defender. I, I say human rights defender because I believe human rights are human rights. Though I have my, my, my area of focus is LGBT rights. Um, yes, I've been an activist since 2010. Uh, it's a long story of what sparked my anger and my personal experience of, of, of being sent out of my family because of my sexuality. I always say I'll not get worse than what I got in the first time. Because my first incident was my family disowning me, telling me that no, Najib, pack up all your things and leave our house. I didn't, I didn't, I've ever, I've ne I never thought that in life, my mother that I loved so much, that I stood with her so many times, that called me this nice child, this, I come from a family of 15, and I'm the 10th child, but I was always the favorite kid at home. So I never knew that things could change because of who I am. But, 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 but my sexuality changed things every, on one day. I couldn't, they, they stopped paying my tuition. I was in my first year of university. My family knew how passionate I was at law. They have, I, I, had, I had two brothers and one sister that had done law, but everybody already said that Najib would be the best lawyer. So everybody knew. So I didn't know that, I couldn't believe that one time, all of them could turn against me and tell me that we cannot, a, a cast person cannot be a lawyer. So I think what I got from the beginning, to me, I always say I'll not get anything worse than that. Because if it's death, everybody dies. It's just a matter of time. So every time, I've gone through so many, so many incidents being called, called a monster, being beaten. One time, 2011, my house was set on fire. I just got out of fire. I've gotten, been, been, been to police so many times, but every time that happens, I'm like, yes. Let it happen so that it, drive, it drives me to be part of the drivers of change. This is, this is, this is a kanzu. A kanzu it's, it's a traditional wear for, for Baganda people. So it's, 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 it's always put on, on an introduction ceremony, on a, fin, on a rust funeral rite, and for elder men. Uh, today, I could, I could say today, this is my first pride out, because all the prides I've been having in Uganda, that you have attended, just been closeted in a room, maybe at a beach somewhere, you're so out of security, what and what. So, but today, this is my first pride, my first open pride. I'm very much excited. First of all, I'm excited that I'm part of the first Utrecht Canal Pride, some part of the history. Um, going to the board, of course, seeing, of, of, of course, being in front of a camera all the time today, meeting, meeting people, talking to, to, to meeting, meeting my other human rights, LGBT human rights defender from Nigeria and from Russia. Then dancing afterwards, there's a part of our own body talk, having fun, taking beers, meeting new friends and hearing good stories. They don't want, I don't want to hear sad stories. So I just want to hear good stories. It energize me, inspire me, and... And they'll put me in good mood and just celebrate. It's your first bicycle lesson. How did it go? Oh my God. What do you it's think scaring. It's, it's not scaring. I was like, oh, I'm going to fall down and miss my day. Well, I think it, it, it feels good. It's scary, but then it feels good. You'll try again once. Yes, I'll try. Not once. I'll try again and again and again and again. Mm -hmm. I met I met Alexia from Russia. I met Judith from 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 Nigeria. So I've met people. I've met people from Senegal, from 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 different countries. Activists. Uh, my name is Alexei. I'm from Russia. I'm an LGBT activist from Russia. Okay. Why, why are you in Utrecht? Uh, because I'm on gay pride in Utrecht. Um, I meet in Najib, and we're having together a good time to celebrate the pride.
Space International is uh, de implementatiepartner van Shelter City Utrecht. Uh, Shelter City Pro uh, Project is een landelijk project uh, gecoördineerd door Justice and Peace. Dat is een organisatie in Den Haag. Uh, en Shelter City Utrecht is een samenwerking tussen Peace Brigades International, PBI, de gemeente Utrecht, uh, de Universiteit Utrecht, SIM en uh, het UAF. Uh, en wij van PBI, wij zorg, we zijn dus degene die uh, het project hier in Utrecht in uitvoering brengen. Waarom is het dan zo bijzonder dat die mensen hier op dit moment zijn? Uh, dus de eerste keer dat ze een Pride meemaken, uh, ze hebben gewoon... Uh, als ze, als ze iets vieren met hun vrienden, dan is het in een, in een kleine, kleine groep binnen huis vaak. Dus dit is de eerste keer dat ze nu in alle vrijheid in, in het open gewoon uh, hun seksualiteit kunnen uiten. En uh, zichzelf kunnen zijn. Dus samen is het een heel speciaal moment. Support human rights because we are all equal and we are all as humans. We have dignity. Human rights are human rights. Human rights are right to life. So supporting human rights, you are giving a life. You are giving, you are giving someone life. So support PBI, support Peace Brigade International, support Shelter City to support life. Because when you support human rights, you are supporting life. You are giving someone a right to live.